Hi, I'm Jacqueline Stack. I am an artistic designer at Z Salon & Spa. I've been here for just about 20 years. I came to Z Salon & Spa right out of hair school, so fresh. And the biggest draw was the fact that there was not a lot of competitive behavior within the salon. Naturally, we always focus on um, how we can be better than the next stylist, but at Z Salon, we really encourage each other to rise one another up. So walking in, it felt more like an individual uh, unity together. So working more teamwork versus just for yourself. And that goes into, we don't accept tips. So we try to really hone in on just the guest. We're doing what we do for them, not for us. So starting here at just shy of 20, it was really nice because I didn't have to worry about finding my own health insurance. We have a team that sets it up and they provide um, different coverage plans and options as well as 401k. I was given paid time off um, as well as the comfort of an hourly rate versus just strictly commission. Being out of hair school, you come in with no clientele base and so you're building your craft. And with that, Z Salon delivers that for you. They give you a handful of guests and your job is to retain them and make them feel special. Working with an hourly rate, it balances out where you range anywhere from 35 to 45% uh, commission on an hourly, so you're paid up front. And what that means is if you have someone that doesn't show up in a commission setting, you don't get paid. Well, at Z Salon, we allow you to get paid because we believe that what you'll deliver on the other end will compensate for that you know, lack of appointment. So they really put their faith and trust, whether it be in education, uh, right out of the, the gate, you're funded. You know, We've got top level stylists. We bring in people from all across the United States and internationally to educate our staff, as well as in-house mentor and training programs. One of the drawing points with Z Salon when I first started here was I wanted to be as involved as possible. So doing hair for the community wasn't enough for me, but I felt like being with a group that represented Louisville and they really put their best foot forward in constantly picking out charities per year that we raise money for, as well as we've done Operation Brightside, we've done Habitat for Humanity, uh, we're constantly, if any of our guests are in need, we collaborate as a team and as a family. And we pull together and we make sure that we keep the people that we love their heads high.